Sunin, guide me. Everything a Muspel princess could ever want. Are you lost, Desir? Well, that depends. I'm looking for someone. I was told I might find her here. Maybe you know her. Muspel, around your age. Goes by Asa. Father's a... Uh, how shall I put this? A vainglorious fool who thinks himself a god. Never heard of her. Then you will not mind if I stay a while. Dip my toes in one of these soothing fire baths. I have a better idea. Oh. Turn around. Go back from where you came. And please, do mind your step. That is no way to welcome a curious outsider. Care to put that away? Why? Afraid I know how to use it? I'm sure you can use it. Passably well. But then I would have to kill you. Don't worry. You won't. Goodbye, Ethan. There's an easy way out of this. Now where is the fun in that? Let's keep the baubles out of it, shall we? Oh, 
no. The godly gloating. Smite me, I cannot bear it. If I were you, I would save the tongue wit for a more appropriate time. I saw no such trinket on Sutter. Yet he too has a problem with dying. So that was you and A3. What squabble had you trading blows with my father? He has taken my son. And now I will give your father a taste of what he has wrought. Move, so that I may trade his child for mine. <laughs> you clearly do not know my father. Your son, Baldr, I assume. He has something my father needs. And if that is so, Papa would sooner see me dead than give in to your demands. If you want your son back, you will need something far more precious than me to barter with. Me, his own daughter? I simply will not do. Then there's no longer any need for you to draw breath. Asa! We found it! We found. Oh! Found what? <laughs> what have you found? Uh, Asa would not want me to say. Asa is no longer here. I am Harvey of Asgard, Lord of Frenzy. And you are in full control of my temper. I'm, 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 I'm a mural. Asa believes it may help her gain entry to an ancient vault. It is in a cavern that way. So long as Sutter lives, my son will be his prisoner. But how does one kill that which cannot be killed? If death is not his weakness, then I must find something that is. of which may allude to peaks or mountains. You! Can you read this to me? Me? Uh, I, uh, I, I can try. Elven runes are not something I can decipher with ease. You will fare better than I, and that will have to do. Any mention of an ancient vault, a door, secret entrance, maybe? Uh, no, uh, but uh, I can make out this. See? Two great mountains to the north, the sun and moon above. That's it? Regrets, Asir. We are simple diggers, not experts of things writ long ago. Not to worry. You've been a great help. The wall is located between two great mountains to the north. I should search there. Gone from here, please.
Go, Sunan. Footprints like these. One set larger than the rest. Sigrun and Alstein. Whoever did this, I will see that there is a price to pay. The wounds in their chests. Identical and cauterized. I've seen nothing like it. It's. Natural. Whoever was here made it a point to occupy this space.
Were the victims still alive? Ace has sought to enter this vault and unlock its secrets. But before she could do so, someone beat her to it. A being that a group of Muspels here, Sigrun and Holstein, were likely prisoners among them. Injured, but very much alive. Dwarfs were taken to the center of this chamber, where it appears that some sort of ritual was prepared. The orchestrator came for the ancient elven object built into the wall. Possibly even used it in the ritual. Is that what led to the dwarves' death? The Muspels then left, taking the object with them. But the purpose of this ritual of theirs remains a mystery to me. That sigil... I think I glimpsed it before in Atri while I searched for Balda. Perhaps we'll find some answers there. about this land, my friend. What's happening? Look soon in there.
Show me. See you, old friend. on the ritual. They are performed at night. There is emphasis on something called a salakar. My elven is rusty. Vessel of souls, I think. Is this the object from the vault? The culprit searches for a Jotun and a Muspel subject to complete their work. Muspel's killing Muspel's. about the culprit's affairs. Only she and Sutra I wear. You're light on your feet, Asa. Following me now? You've become quite useful, Aesir. My gratitude for opening the vault. Now tell me, what happened there? I'm following the stink as it rises. As are you. Care to tell me why that is? Days ago, Sinmara ordered my best warriors to the vault without bothering to inform me. I've not heard from them since. Well, you're casting your suspicions at the right people. Whose quarters are these? His name is Calder, an adept in magic. Or Seder, as you Asgardians sometimes call it. This place is where he practices it. Whatever he's doing, it is not Seder. At least not as I know it. He is using something called a Salakar. It's part of a deadly ritual. And from what this room tells me, the dead will continue to pile up. Dwarves. Yotna. Muspels. I don't know what you're talking about. You wouldn't. Your stepmother despises and distrusts you. Your father only the latter of those. For now. But in time, thanks to her venomous whispers, he may come to hate you as much as she does. This is a lie. All of it. Your twisted attempt to pit me against them. 
Sift through the mesh yourself. No other truth lies within. Where are you going? After the Salakar. Whatever it is, your father needs it. it Maybe the only leverage I have to get my son back. Calder marked the place on the map surrounded by waters just northeast. If he's planning another ritual there, I may be able to understand what value this Salakar holds. This is heavy. Calder may be nearby. This move should give me a clear view. permission we will now return to Asa. Soon. I have need for you still. Asa's warriors. Where do they fit into all this? You are one of our captains, yes? A duty I share with two others here. I thought I saw something in you. Stout. Resolute. Step over here. Sigrun and Halstein were two of the most revered sons of Ivaldi. If such prestige is a requirement for these rituals, then Calder is surely luring that Muspel to his death. I wonder if there's a way I can observe the ritual up close. I need to approach Calder without him taking notice. Perhaps the best way is with deception. Come, join me, chosen ones. Together. That suit as well. Who among you will hold that distinct honor? Let us see. I need your eyes, my friend. These fools dared stand in her path. Oh, 
How hard was he knocked into this rock? Most likely dead upon impact. reveals her direction. Called us too. And most importantly, the Salah cars. They are headed west. Show me what lies ahead. Freya wonders why I have always refused to take her on a tour of that scorched dunghill. Two sets of footprints. One is stretched, like someone fled. The other closer together, uneven and lined with blood. They were hobbling, perhaps. attention here. Bloodbag! Where are you, Prince? 
Spells. Ragnarok came early. There was a cart here, and drag marks leading to it. Asa chased Kelder into this camp, leaking her lifeblood, blinded by rage and utterly reckless. <sighs> Looks to have cost her too. She came crashing in, mauling whatever half-wit stood between her and Calder. But those half-wits fought back in numbers. Injured and disarmed, she was overpowered and restrained. Calder then had her tossed onto a cart like a sack of turnips. Looks like they fled up that path. What is it Calder plans to do with the little princess now that she is his prisoner? Surely not. These tracks lead west. I must find Calder and the Salakar. For Baldur's sake. Is this blood Asus? Or is she still proving too much to handle? here for a moment before continuing. Most likely to re-secure Asa's bonds. Even in her sorry state, I imagine her to be quite the handful. She even bested me. Temporarily. Perhaps Baldur would not approve of my methods. Of the cruelty I must perform on his behalf. He and Asa, they're young, pure of heart, but lacking in logic. One day they will grow up and see life as I see it. In the meantime, they must rely on me to ensure they live long enough to achieve that wisdom. And so, I do not have the luxury of being faultless. They made a turn here toward the river. I hope I'm not too late. Is that you again, mad one? Come to tempt fate, I see. I do not die this day. Can you say the same? <laughs> ah, yes. You've proven once already how you like to strut around, unencumbered by fear. Perhaps... The Salakar did not give you an adequate taste of it. Enough of this blithering. Hand over what is now mine. Or shall I just take it? To no fear, we must be subjected to it. When I am through with you, I will take Asus, willful Uger. Soon after, the Salakar will be complete. Then, believe me, you will know fear. And pain. Just like your son. Is that your best? Come now, Harvey. Boy, put up more of a fight. <laughs>
Ask yourself how much you care to suffer in these final moments. Do your worst. You are wasting your breath. He will not tell you. And he won't have to. His secrets are known to me now. You want them? Move aside. Move aside or I will destroy it. Traitor! Traitor? It is you who are slaughtering your own kind. What I do, I do for Sultan! Such devotion requires a strong Hugar. All these Muspel sacrifices, you needed only look inward. Was he right? About you wanting to complete the Salakar? Sutra will not trade my son for something he cannot use. So you will see it through? To what end? How many lives would you take? For Balda, I would drain all nine realms. Even Asgard. The words of a dreadful king. And a selfless father. It is the one thing that separates you from my own. You wish to reunite with your son. I wish to see my father's plans lie in ruin. No matter the price. Can you see both through? I can. But I will need your help. The Selikar still requires the hooker of a suitable Jotun. Colta never found one. I must get hunting. Do as you will. In the meantime, I'll join my stepmother, wherever she may be. I will try to learn how the Salakar fits into my father's plans. Under the guise of a contrite stepdaughter, of course. Keep it. I will need a way to find you when it is time to confront my father. You and this bauble share a bond. I set out to use you to my advantage. It ends with me in your debt. If it were not for you, I would have never known what my father was capable of. He used our people. Turned them on each other. For his gain. I cannot forgive him. And to that end, I am your ally. In Asgard, an ally is a friend. Let us not get carried away. 